Hey guys, what's going on? It's Sam with MobileTechVideos.com back with our international version Galaxy S4. This is 9500 and we're going to take a look at a really cool ROM. Alright, so the ROM we're taking a look at today is the Omega ROM and this one, like I said, for the S4. I have uh, reviewed the Omega ROMs before in the past for other devices and has always been one of the top ROMs in my opinion. A lot of developers will try and uh, throw as much junk in there as they can, try and make it as flashy as possible and sometimes you suffer in other areas. But uh, the Omega ROMs have been always been just spot on, has all the latest goodies, hacks, tweaks, mods, and uh, performance, stability, everything has been great. And this one is also the same way. So we'll fire it up here. It's got a cool little boot animation. I'll let you guys watch here as it fires up. And we'll talk about it here in a second. So it's got the Omega medallion spinning there. Stutters a little bit because everything's loading, but uh, and then it doesn't last very long. It's already about to fire up. You got the lion on the one side and then the android on the other. Really, really cool. So we'll set this here for a second and we'll talk about it. This is Omega version 9. Uh, Jelly Bean 4.2.2. It's based on the latest firmware XWBMF8. And it has the stock kernel, the stock modem, all the same. BusyBox, rooted, DODEX, zip aligned, all those. Flash support, uh, it's got the battery mod, call recorder. He's taken out the increasing ringtone, which I'm glad for because that thing is annoying. And a ton of little things uh, like unlimited contacts to SMS, removed SMS from the call log, enabled sub symbols on the stock Samsung keyboard, uh, little things. One of the main things that um, he's been able to do is really cut down on the lag. We all know that the S4 suffers from some really pretty bad lag and now that they've brought out the Google edition S4 it's obvious that the lag is completely touch whiz but uh, he's taken care of that cut out most of the lag all right sorry about that I had a bunch of apps updating in the background there I had to turn off so uh, but like I said the the lag is definitely much much less than it was there's still a little bit of lag a little bit of delay uh, when you press something it's not super instantaneous but it's really, he's done a great job of cutting down. So this is, like I said, Omega version 9. And real quick, if you get this ROM, keep an eye out for the updates because this thing is getting updated super quick. I put version 6 on here before I went to, on my vacation a couple weeks ago. Uh, literally, it's been less than a month. And just yesterday was going to make this video, decided I should probably look to see if there were any updates and checked, and it's already up to version 9. So, definitely stay up on the updates and flash those when they come out. I wish the download was quicker for the Omega ROMs. It's always been super slow. It took me about two hours to download just this one ROM, when normally it might take, you know, five minutes. So, uh, but that's fine I can live with that to get such an awesome awesome ROM basically stock look and feel just with all the uh, goodies added in to make it super fast and reliable and stable so when you install this ROM you also get the Omega files app which uh, provides quick and easy download of all the extras that come for this ROM. Now you pick the device you have, which we have the S4. Choose which uh, model you have. We have the 9500. Click on that. 
And here's a bunch of stuff that we can uh, download and flash. Animations, kernels, modems. You have several things that are good for all of the Omega ROMs. And then you have some down here, themes and mods that are only for version 9. So, really great tool to have uh, in conjunction with the ROM. Clear everything out here. And maybe even go in and clear the RAM. Okay. And then we'll run a quadrant. Let's see what kind of score we get. So I'll be right back with that score. All right, here is the score. 12,778. That's awesome. So, really, really good score there. All in all, a great ROM. I highly recommend it. Spinning Medallion taking us out. This is the Mega ROM version 9 for the Galaxy S4 international version. Chances are there is a, an Omega ROM for whatever Galaxy S4 you are using. So check it out in XDA. I'll put a link down below to this ROM and where you can find it. And guys, always, always thank the developers. These guys work super hard on these ROMs and uh, these mods and all these things, and they need our support. Thank them. If you're feeling generous, you can send them a donation as well. And don't forget to check us out, mobiletechvideos.com, complete source for all your mobile device needs. This is Sam, and I'll see you next time.